that ending right there kind of feels like how this last six -ish games have gone for you guys. Yeah, you know it is. Uh, you know we uh, just don't, just not playing like we need to play. Obviously, you know. I mean, like Ewing's absence is really crucial, and good to have Slade back today. Obviously, felt his presence with the two-run homer, but. You know, the double play haunted us again today. It hurt us in the first inning. I mean, we had him on the ropes, and he escapes with one run. And, you know, that's a, that's a time where you could really have set the tone for, for this game, and, and, it, and, it, and it missed on that. And then, of course, in the last inning, um, you know, Johnson does a great job pinch hit double, getting on, and Montenegro moves him over, and then, you know, it just didn't work out. So I was going to say that last inning, finally get a hit off that believer, but just um, – You'd like to maybe put some pressure on him a little bit more in, uh, in the first few innings when that relief is coming in. Yeah, you know, I mean, of course, we're hitting five left-handed. I don't have a lot of options to use, so, you know, we're, we're left-handed tight, So and that guy did a good job against us, um, and we just never really got any good swings off from him. Credit their first baseman. He made some great plays today. You know, he picked the ball from a third baseman over there. He picked the ball from McGillis's last at bat. Uh, and then, of course, he started a 3-6-3. So, you know, to me, he was the player of the day out there for them. I mean, he really saved them some some opportunities that, that we were trying to create. What happened to Hunter in that, uh, in that, that, that fifth inning there? He looked like he, he had got two quick outs and then yeah, was coast, you know, cruising along. And four then straight like hits. And, you know, we were one play away, you know, from not them not getting any mm -hmm. score, you know. And today, you know, Charlie works out there in, the, in, in practice, but, you know, he doesn't play in the game. And, with you, and we're just trying to get as much offense as we can in there right now, and, and we feel like that his bat has been there before. You know, we're hoping it'll get back there where we need it, and uh, tough play for a guy that doesn't play out there every day, but, uh, you know, I was I was surprised that that ball stayed in, in all honesty. Off the bat, I thought it was it was gone like Wilkes's was, and uh, but but it held up, and, uh, you know, it, it worked out for them. We don't like the way Dalton Rogers has come on here for, uh, you know, lately, these last two or three weeks. It really gives you a plus. It really gives you one more good Yeah, the you know, him and there. him and Storm last yeah. night. I mean, we got to have that left-hander that, that can step up for us. Storm's obviously a fresh arm. Dalton's been used several times. But, you know, what he gave us today, three innings, eight strikeouts, one walk, and really just held it there in one run. I mean, you couldn't ask for anything better, than, you know, out of your reliever in that situation. And, and that's what we asked him to do, and he did exactly that. We just didn't take care of business on the offensive side. Well, Scott, you never want to hit a, hit a down point. But is it better to kind of have this happen now rather than two weeks from now when you're kind of you know, struggling? Because you got time yeah, now to Yeah, you know, I think, into, he, I mean, you, you hear play. that all the time. I mean, but, you know, you practice to, to win. Mm -hmm. You know, that's what you do. And, and uh, certainly, you know, the 15-game winning streak put us on a real high, and, and uh, what, you know, you knew you was going to lose one at some point. Uh, but, you know, when you've tasted that, that win for so long and so many consecutive days, I mean, we won 27 days, you know, that we never experienced a loss. And, and now we've, uh, you know, back-to-back -back weekends where we just hadn't played well enough to, to win a series. And, and uh, you know, we've we got to figure it out. I'm going to call on leadership from our team within. You know, I've been complimenting them the whole year. And it's time now. Now is the challenge, as it is with us as, as coaches. But you know, it's also the challenge internally. Coach, status on where Reese is at? I don't know. I mean, he's got a broke hand, and I hope he's back next weekend. But I'm sure he won't be. You know, I have no idea. Uh, you know, they X-rayed it the other day, and it's a little better, but it's still it's still air in there, and it's still broke. So, you know, I just get up, say my prayers, and hope he's back in the lineup next weekend because we need him. Coach, take us back to the second. What happened with the play at the plate? Uh, he said he didn't didn't tag him. I mean, I don't know. You know, I don't know if he tagged him or not. But um, do you think he was out of the base pass? No, I didn't. Now I haven't seen a replay, but I really, I really didn't. You know, that was kind of the one thing from my angle that I, that I was looking at. He just kind of hold, you know, went around him, and uh, you know, we don't we don't execute on that one, and and uh, you know, everything was right there to. To stop that run from scoring, but we just we didn't get it done. And you know, hey, right now, Old Dominion's a better team than us. I mean, if you want to know the truth, I mean, they're they're swinging the bat better than us. They're playing defense better than us. I mean, they're they're doing a lot. Their pitchers are stepping up. Our guys are throwing good. But you know, their guys last night has got you know through good, and you 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 put on their good offense and good defense, and 
you have what we were experiencing for a long time. Mm-hmm. You know, I, I, it's hard for me to believe that that record isn't better on their team, uh, in all honesty. So, uh, but you know, maybe they have gone through something that that uh, we don't know about, obviously. So. So, uh, Coach, what's the message for tomorrow just to get back on track to just close out the series with a, a, at least a home win? To get up, get back on track? have an attitude, and, you know, backs are against the wall. I mean, we experienced it last weekend where our backs are against the wall. And, uh, you know, you fear a team who is uh, who who comes off that wall. You know, if you don't come off the wall, there's nothing to fear. So, you know, it's get up and salvage one. That's all you can do. Sweeps are they're devastating. So. Yep. All right. All right. Thank you. Yes, sir.